Welcome to Goodwe Training Series. Today we will take you through the Wi-Fi Plus LAN kit configuration for PV plant monitoring. Wi-Fi and LAN communication are commonly used for the PV plant monitoring. The inverter can upload the data to the cloud through Wi-Fi or LAN. Then we can monitor our inverter remotely. Goodwe provides two types of Wi-Fi modules. In addition to Wi-Fi modules, Goodwe has developed Wi-Fi Plus LAN kit, which integrates Wi-Fi Plus LAN into one to support both wireless and wired connection with the router. LAN communication is now receiving more attention since it is more stable, easier to configure, and has a longer communication distance compared to Wi-Fi communication. The Wi-Fi commissioning for this Wi-Fi Plus LAN kit is the same as Wi-Fi module. And today we will introduce the LAN configuration. The commissioning steps are as below. 1. Install the Wi-Fi Plus LAN kit. Before we start the commissioning, we should install the Wi-Fi Plus LAN kit. With the plug and play design, we only need to plug the kit to the COM port of the inverter. 2. Power on and check the communication status. We need to power on the inverter and make sure the local router works fine. Open the waterproof cover of the Wi-Fi Plus LAN kit. Then remove the rubber seal ring. Insert the network cable and plug it into the Wi-Fi Plus LAN kit. Tighten the cover. Plug the other end of the network cable into the router. Then we can check the communication status of the Wi-Fi Plus LAN kit through indicators. There are two indicators for the Wi-Fi Plus LAN kit. Power and COM indicators. The lit green power indicator means the Wi-Fi Plus LAN kit is powered on. And when the blue COM indicator lights up, it means the proper communication on Wi-Fi mode or the Wi-Fi AP hotspot is connected. 3. Then we can start the Wi-Fi commissioning of Wi-Fi Plus LAN kit. We provide two methods. Commissioning via SAM's portal app. Commissioning via web. First method, commissioning via SEMS portal app. Step 1, download and install the SEMS portal app. Step 2, connect the app and the inverter. We need to turn on the WLAN and connect solar Wi-Fi in the phone settings. The last 8 number is the inverter serial number. And the initial password is 12345678. Step 3, network commissioning of the kit. Firstly, open the SEMS portal app and click Wi-Fi configuration. Make sure the device is powered on and click Next. SEMS will recommend to change the password of Solar Wi-Fi for privacy. So we can change the password by clicking Modify Now. Click I am aware of that. Then you will jump to this page. Login with Admin. Select AP Settings. Fill in the new password in the key column. Then click Submit. And when it is set successfully, you need to restart the module. Then you need to reconnect the Wi-Fi module with the new password in the phone settings. Open the SAMS portal app again, click Wi-Fi configuration and click Next. We will jump to this page where we need to do some settings. First of all, select LAN as the internet access port. Enable DHCP for dynamic IP mode. Then click Set. The Wi-Fi plus LAN kit configuration will be completed. And the other way is commissioning via web. The smart device still needs to be connected to solar Wi-Fi. Here we use computer to do the commissioning. First step, log into 10.10.100.253 with admin. Click sign in. Select STA settings. The current wireless network will be selected by default, or you can also search it manually. Next step is to enter the wireless network password and click submit. Now it is set successfully, you can restart the module to use new setting. 4. We can also change the password after the setting. Still in the AP settings page. We can enter the new password in the key column. Then click submit, and restart the module to use the new setting. Now the password is successfully changed. After we complete the configuration, we can check the COM indicator on Wi-Fi Plus LAN kit and the power indicator on the inverter. That's all for the Wi-Fi Plus LAN kit configuration. Thank you for watching. For more installation and configuration videos of Goodwe training series, please visit our Goodwe community and stay tuned to our official account.